Okay, moving on to the string cheese picker. They're the ones who peel at those little hangnails until they become big problems. Okay, so the condition of your nails, nails are usually fine. Uh, the peely skin around the nails can become tender and raw and inflamed. No biting occurs. This is really a skin-based tendency. So let's look at the condition of the cuticles and skin. Cuticles will have a tendency to shred and peel from normal daily activity. There's a tendency to pick at the peeling skin and it can cause mild to severe wounds. And the peeling and the wounds are usually behind the cuticle line. So we're really dealing with a skin issue. So signs and symptoms that present in your diagnosis. Uh, you can have red, swollen, and tender skin around your nails. If it stings, if your cuticles are exposed to lemon juice. Uh, your nails look unkempt, even though they may not be bitten. You experience more peeling during the normal daily activities by putting your hands in pockets, digging into backpack, backpacks, backpacks, etc. Sorry about that. And you may benefit from a hand fidget tool as well. So let's take a look at what it looks like. Um, okay, so the string cheese picker, your triggers are not necessarily an all-consuming urge. Uh, the nails, and you wish your nails and fingers would look prettier, and you may resort to cuticle trimmers or nippers to try and control that dried, peeling cuticle look. And unfortunately, what happens, again, like I was mentioning earlier, body's response to damage is build more skin. And so we're creating that problem that we're trying to avoid. So what do we do? Again, you're gonna notice um, some repetitive <laughs> treatments here, um, but we found these to be so, so helpful. So again, hydration. Hydration to your body, make sure that you're drinking plenty of water, and then also hydration to the nails and the skin actually means oil. So um, for string cheese pickers, you may find a benefit in removing the cuticle, which is actually that dead skin on the nail plate. Um, and you will want to gently push back your proximal fold, which we think of as the cuticle. You want to do that about every five days using a cuticle remover uh, cream or gel. And I like the ones that have more of the gel-like consistency. Like in this photo of the Sally Hansen. Avoid Blue Cross cuticle remover because it's so liquid that actually the lye in it helps dissolve your live skin even more, which can cause more shredding hangnails, which then of course we're gonna rip at. Um, for sure, keep baby nail clippers on hand to gently trim the peelies as they show up and keep a fidget toy around in case you need that physical input.